أحبابنا المؤمنين إن كل عين باكية يوم القيامة غير ثلاثة أعين. He said, Oh, those whom I love, every eye will cry on the day of rising except three. إلا عين بكت من خشية الله. Except an eye that cried out of reverent fear of Allah. وعين غضت عن محارم الله. And an eye which was closed to prevent looking at forbidden things. وعين سهرت في سبيل الله. And an eye that was wakeful in the way of Allah. وفي مظاهر العظمة لقي الأمير سيدنا سالم بن عبد الله بن عمر بن الخطاب وسط الكعبة. And the manifestations of this magnificence, the Amir met Salim, the son of Abdullah bin Umar, uh, in the Kaaba. قال ألك حاجة يا سالم. He said, Oh Salim, do you have a need? قال أستحي أن أسأل غيره وأنا في بيته. He said, I'm ashamed to ask other than him when I'm in his house, the Kaaba. فخجل الأمير. So then the Amir was shy. فتعرض له خارج المسجد. So then he met him outside of the masjid. قال الآن صرت خارج المسجد لك حاجة. He said, now you're outside of the masjid. قال تعني. You have a need. قال تعني من حوائج الدنيا أم من حوائج الآخرة. He said, do you mean a worldly need or an otherworldly need? قال أما الآخرة فلا سبيل لي عليها ولكن من حوائج الدنيا. He said, as for the hereafter, I can't do anything about that. I mean, uh, a worldly need. قال أما الدنيا فأنا لم أسألها من مالكها فكيف أسألها من غير مالكها؟ He said, as for the world, I don't seek it from its owner. So how could I seek it from other than its owner? أنا ما سألتها من الله الذي يملكها. I didn't ask Allah for it, the one who possesses it. جل جلاله وتعالى في علاه. Magnificent is he and sublime in his greatness. أيها المؤمنون. انطلقوا في دنياكم على اتخاذ قرارات ترضي الرب عنكم. Oh, you believers, go forth in this life making decisions which will cause the Lord to be pleased with you. تحكموا في ما توصلون إلى أسماع وأبصار أبنائكم وبناتكم. Determine well, control that which reaches the eyes and the ears of your sons and daughters. فمن باب الأسماع والأبصار وصل أعداء الله إلى ساحات القلوب. Through the two doors of hearing and seeing, the enemies entered the arenas of our hearts or the hearts. ولو احتلال ساحات القلوب من قبل كفار لما قدر الكفار أن يحتل شبرا من الساحات الأرضية للمؤمنين. Were the disbelievers not to have occupied the lands of the hearts, they would not have occupied one hand span of the Muslim lands. Prepare for your eyes to see the faces of prophets on the day of rising and the faces of the companions and folk of the prophet وفي هذه العظمة وحسن التحكم لما يجري بينكم تحكم في ألسنتكم وما يدور منها. And in this magnificence and the good judgment and control of your affairs, control your tongues. إن أعراض المؤمنين غالية عند الله. He said, indeed, the reputations of believers are precious with Allah. لقد أشارت السيدة عائشة بيدها وقالت حسبك من فلانة تعني أنها قصيرة. Our liege lady Aisha, Allah be pleased with her, uh, indicate, made a sign with her hand and say, so and so is sufficient, meaning that يعني, she's enough, meaning she's short. فهذبها النبي. So the prophet uh, disciplined her. خير مؤدب ومربي. The best one that would teach manners and rear. وكشف لها عن حقيقة حال المؤمن عند الله. And he unveiled for her the reality of a believer with Allah. قال يا عائشة لقد قلت كلمة لو مزجت بماء البحر لمزجته. He said, Oh Aisha, you said a word were it to have been mixed with the water of the ocean, it would have rendered it impure or, or rendered it uh, turbid. ارعوا الحرمات بينكم. Be cautious, careful, 
of sacred things amongst each other. And also be cautious of uh, the inviolability of your predecessors from the people of the first and second generations and what was thereafter. فرقهم الحق تبارك وتعالى في بلدانكم التي جيتم منها. And be cautious of the inviolability of pious people whom Allah caused to spread forth in the various lands. إن حرمتهم عند الله تبارك وتعالى كبيرة. Indeed, their sacredness, their sanctity with Allah تبارك وتعالى is great. إن سباب المسلم فسوق وقتاله كفر. He said, indeed, verbally abusing a Muslim is corruption and fighting him is disbelief. كان يقف بعض الصحابة على الكعبة المشرفة. Some of the companions stood upon the noble Kaaba. فيقول أعلم أن حرمتك عند الله عظيمة. And he said, I know that your magnificent, your sanctity with Allah is great. ولكني أعلم أن حرمة الرجل المؤمن أعظم عند الله منك. However, I know that the sanctity of a believing man is greater with Allah than yours. هذه الرعاية من أمانتكم أيها المؤمنون. He said, this caution concerning each other's inviolability is a trust with you from Allah, O believers. لا يقوم دينكم على شباب ولا على شتائم. This religion of yours is not based on 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 verbal abuse. وارحموا من يقع في شتم أوائله وعزه وشرفه من حيث يشعر ومن حيث لا يشعر. Have mercy upon the one who wounds, who wounds his predecessors and his honor unknowingly. فلن تقوم الساعة حتى يلعن آخر هذه الأمة أولها. It was said the day of resurrection will not occur until the end of this nation curses the beginning of this nation. ونادى النبي علماء أمة على الخصوص في تلك الأزمنة أن يظهر علمه. أن يظهر. يظهر علمهم. And the prophet told the scholars, particularly at that time, to to manifest their knowledge. قال فإن كاتم العلم يوم إذن ككاتم ما أنزل على محمد. He said someone who conceals knowledge on that day is like someone who conceals that which was revealed to Muhammad. صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ورعاية الحرمة لهؤلاء بمعرفة عظمة طريقتهم ومنهجهم. And being cautious of their sanctity is by knowing the greatness of their way and their method. ورحمتنا لمن خالف ذلك المنهج وتسمى بأي اسم أن نقوم بحق العلم بحسن البيان. And our mercy towards the one who has opposed that way, whatever their name may be, is that we convey or fulfill the due of knowledge and teach this person. وأن لا نفتح أبواب المجادلات ولا المشاتمات. That we clarify the message to them, though we do not open the doors to debate and dispute. وأن نحسن ربوعنا ومحيطاتنا من تسرب السوء والشر إليهم بأنواعه. And that we protect our homes and that which surrounds us from various types of wickedness flowing into them. وأن نطلب العيش في المحبة في الله والأخوة في الله. And that we seek to live in love for the sake of Allah and brotherhood for the sake of Allah. ومن لم يساعدنا في ذلك قلنا له أعرضنا عنه وقلنا كف شرك عنا. And someone who does not assist us in this, we ignore them and we say, keep your harm from us. إن لم تعاون إخوانك المؤمنين على محبتهم ووحدتهم وأخوتهم فلا تكون مصدر تفريق وبعث شرور وبغضاء بينهم. If you do not assist your brothers in their love and their unity and their brotherhood, then at least do not be a cause of wickedness and harm befalling them. فَإِنَّ شِرَارَنَا الْمَشَّاءُونَ بِالنَّمِيمَةَ الْمُفَرِّقُونَ بَيْنَ الْأَحِبَّةِ For indeed the most wretched of us are those who carry tales and, and cause uh, severance 
between lovers.